Hello, my name is Regina. In this video, I will explain the 20 powerful Excel function. Sweet function in Microsoft Excel. The sweet function evaluates a given expression against a list of values and will return a result corresponding to the first matching values. In this example, I will provide the title to the rating number, such as 1 is excellent, 2 is good, and 3 is poor. Equal. Click on the switch function. Expression. Is it the way you are expressing too much again? Click on 1. Comma. Where you want. This is the first way you use. Click on 1. Comma. Result 1. This is the title that you will provide to the number one. Click on Excellent, comma. Click on Two, comma. Result Two is good, comma. Click on Three, comma. Result Three is poor. Close parenthesis. Press F4. Press Enter. Click and scroll down. If error function. The if error function in Excel is designed to make error in formula and calculation. In the example, we use the if error function to make error when dividing the number. Equal. Click on 10. Divide by 2. Press enter. Click and scroll down. 3 error result. Now use the if error function to change the error result to flip it. Equal. Click on the if error function. Click on 10. Divide by 2. Comma. Quote. Flip it. Quote. Close parenthesis. Press enter. Click and scroll down. Decade function. Decade function extracts a single value from a column or the list or database that might condition that you specify. In the example, we will find a student mark information using the decade function. Equal. Click on decade function. Database. This is the database rank including header. Select all table. Insert the last symbol. Press F4. Amma Fill This is your field name or index to count Click on name Amma Criteria This is the criteria range including header Select table student ID Press F4 Close parenthesis And press enter 2025 source 01 Click and scroll right. I want to create the drop down list. Click on student ID. Data. Data validation. List. Source. Select all student ID number. And click OK. End function in Microsoft Excel. The end function returns true or false based on your condition. If the result is consistent with your condition, it will display true. And opposite of your condition, it will display false. In the example, I will use two condition to return true or false. Equal. Click on end function. 95 greater than 90. Amma. And 95 less than 100. The result will be true because the 95 is between 90 to 100. Close parenthesis. Press enter. Click and scroll down. 89 is not between 90 to 100, so the result is false. Land function. 
the len function count the len of a given page string. In finding sort underline C, the len function can be useful if we wish to get the length of a given text string as the number or character. Equal. Click on the len function. Click on the text that you want to count. Close parenthesis and press enter. Click and scroll down. Sum XQ function. The sum XQ function returns the sum or the square or the values that you provide. Equal. Click on sum XQ function. Select all the number. Close parenthesis. Press enter. Click and scroll down. Now you the simple solution using the square formula and the sum function. Equal. Click on 10. Multiply, click on 10 again, press enter, click and screw down, equal, click on the sum function, select all the square number, close parenthesis, and press enter. Aggregate function. The aggregate function returns an aggregate calculation like sum, average, count, etc. Ignoring hidden role and error optionally. In this example, I will calculate the total using aggregate function. Firstly, I calculate the result from A divided by B. Click and scroll down. Now use the sum function to calculate the total. Equal Click on the sum function, select all the number, close parenthesis, press enter. The result no work because to sell error. Instead the problem, we use the aggregate function. Equal, click on aggregate function, click on the sum function, comma, click on ignore error values, comma, select all the number again, close parenthesis, and press enter. Exact function. The exact function compared to type and return true is they are the same, and false if they are not the same. In the example, I will find true or false by comparing two names using the exact function. Equal. Click on exact function. Click on name one, comma. Name two. Close parenthesis. Press enter. Click and scroll down. Name 1, the same name 2, so the result is true. Not the same, so the result is false. HLOOKUP function The HLOOKUP function in Excel is a powerful search tool allowing you to find particular values from a range of cells. In this example, I will search all the mark or the student using the HLOOKUP function. Firstly, I use the shortcut key or the sum function to calculate the total mark. Select all the mark. Press R plus equal. Now use the HLOOKUP function. Equal. Click on HLOOKUP function. Lookup underscore values. This is the values that you will be searching. Click on student ID. Hammer. Lookup underscore array. This is the rank that you wish to search. Select all student ID. Comma. Return underscore array. This is the result that you will display. Select table from student name until total mark. Close parenthesis. Press enter. Who 725001? I want to create the drop down list. Substitute function. They say substitute function reflect the type in a given string by matching. In this example, I will remove the hyphen from the full name and insert an underscore between the name and surname using the substitute function. Equal. 
click on the substitute function click on full name comma quote hyphen quote comma quote quote close parenthesis the formula meaning that change the hyphen who knows space or remove the hyphen press enter click and scroll down I want to insert an underscore between name and surname the formula meaning that change space to underscore press enter click and scroll down unique function the unique function remove duplicate values the values can be type number date palm etc in the example i will remove the duplicate name using the unique function equal click on the unique function select all the name close parenthesis and press enter john mario has two names so remove the duplicate into one sum if function the sum if function in itself allow you to calculate the sum of values that meet a specific criteria or condition you define meaning that calculate the sum with one condition in the example i will calculate the subtotal of pen book and pencil using the sum if function equal click on the sum if function rank this is the rank or say that you want to check for your criteria meaning that select all the item comma criteria meaning that use only one condition i want to calculate our quantity of pen so click on pen comma sum underscore rank this is all the number that you want to calculate select all quantity number close parenthesis and press enter total book equal click on the sum if function select all item name comma click on book comma select all quantity number close parenthesis and press enter total pencil close parenthesis and press enter now you the sum function to calculate the total equal click on the sum function select all number close parenthesis and press enter eoman function the eoman function return the serial number for the last day of the month that is the indicate numbers of month before or after start date we use the eoman function to calculate maturity date or due date that fall on the last day of the month equal click on eoman function click on start date comma click on month close parenthesis and press enter double click right click click on format cell date click on format that you want ok meaning that at 1 to January the result is February and the last day of February is 28 minus 1 from the February the result is January and the last day of January is 31 Roman function the is a Roman function convert the number to a Roman numeral attack equal click on the Roman function click on one close parenthesis press enter double click second example click and scroll down the Roman function is not working for the number 4000 and above the average function 
the deeperate function in a cell returns the average values of all cells in a column or database that contain the criteria you set. In this example, I use the deeperate function to calculate the average product cell of pen, book, and eraser. Equal. Click on deeperate function. Database. This is the database range including header. Select all table. Comma. Fill. This is the field name or index to count. Click on cell. Comma. Criteria. This is the criteria range including header. Select table item. Close parenthesis. And fresh in per. Create the drop down list. Transpose function. The transpose function returns a vertical range of cells as the horizontal range or vice versa. Equal. Click on the transpose function. Select the information table. Close parenthesis and press enter. Equal. Transpose function. Select the table header. Close parenthesis and press enter. Second solution. Equal transpose function select all table including header close parenthesis and press enter. ABF function the ABF function in Excel return the absolute values of a number. The function convert negative number to positive number while the positive number remain unaffected. Equal click on ABF function. Click on minus 100, close parenthesis, press enter. Click and scroll down. Convert minus 100 to 100. Positive number is not affected. Small function. The small function returns the smallest values in a data set. In this example, I will use the small function to find the smallest mark of the student. Firstly, I calculate the total mark using the shortcut key or the sum function. Select all table. Press all plus equal. Now I find the smallest mark of the student. Equal. Click on the small function. Array. This is the data set that you will find one among them. Select all total mark. Comma. Hey, this is the smallest position. If you insert one, you will find the first smallest mark. And if you insert two, you will find the second smallest mark. Insert one, close parenthesis, press enter. Who? Press enter. Rep function. The rep function in Excel repeat type a given number of times. In this example, we use the rep function to change the rating number to the symbol star. Equal. Click on the rep function. Click on star. Comma. Click on file. Insert the last symbol. Close parenthesis. Press enter. Double click. Lastly, code function. The code function returns a code number for the first character in a text string. Equal. Click on the code function. Click on AB. Close parenthesis and press enter. Double click. Char function. The char function returns the character specified by a number. Click and scroll down. 